This is Sky News Business. Hello, welcome back to the show. Now, with uncertainty and volatility in investment markets, the threats of national defaults and fears we may be facing a decade of low or lost investment returns, our personal finances and hopes for our future are at risk. Even the hardiest investors are showing signs of worry, anxiety, stress and concern. So, how do we navigate these headwinds when planning our own financial future? Well, join me now to hopefully answer that and plenty more as Angus Dockel, Principal Advisor at McIntyre Financial Advisory. Angus, great to have you on board. Obvious question, so much volatility, so much turmoil. How hard is it just to keep a level head and a perspective through it all when sort of, I suppose, trying to navigate and, and keep in mind your goals? Uh, I think the, the main issue I see around that is that uncertainty isn't you. Mm. Uh, the world has always been uncertain. Uncertainty isn't an invention of the GFC. So I think as mum and dad investors in planning for their retirement, they need to recognise that. And they also need to perhaps plan for the certainty of uncertainty. And I feel that those that plan for the certainty of uncertainty uh, are going to be better armed to deal with the ongoing lingering doubts about are you know, we going to hit a GFC too, mm. uh, the, 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 the sovereign issues in Europe, all these crises that we're going to continue to face, which is just part of that uncertain, normal world. People are sort of saying, OK, brilliant, what do I do? How do I make money in this sort of market? What are, what are some of the... the the ways people go about sort of, you know, sticking to some sort of sticking to some sort of plan, and what should the plan be? Well, I think they need to get perspective. The two, two 21st century skills that we need in abundance as investors through this uncertain period comes down to having perspective, mm. so we can make those smarter decisions and bridge that gap, achieve that prize that that eight percent was missing, uh, and be resilient. Now, for some of us, we get that perspective and resilience in our own being. I mean, it comes naturally to us. Uh, but I suspect that uh, most of us need to get that perspective, get that resilience from a third party uh, with some objectivity who's a little bit more removed from that initial, oh, I need to get out, hmm. uh, need to stop that pain. All right, Angus, great to talk. Thanks for coming in this evening. Pleasure. Angus Dockle from McIntyre Financial Advisory. That is all we have time for on tonight's show. Thanks for watching. Uh, see you tomorrow.